But if you were put in charge of the team that was to go in and investigate this, this international consortium I keep talking about in 72 hours, give the audience the two or three things you would demand to see, people to interview, what would be the leading things you'd want to see immediately? So I think we should check through all the talking record, including email, the deleted email, and all those texts. And I'm sure the, uh, their technique is high, in, high enough to get some previous uh, even phone call record. We should see what they have been done through the whole COVID-19 and before that. And especially we should focus in on those top experts like Prof. Malik Paris, like uh, Prof. Shi Zhengli, all these people, what they have been done before and after the COVID-19 outbreak. Why there are so many lies? I mean, as uh, researchers, it's easy to say this virus genome has something very weird. And why so many scientists stand up to send the answer that statement that oh we praise chinese government's uh fight uh, effort for anti-covid-19 every word should every country should learn from them and also definitely this is come from nature why do they make up such lies and also we should go thoroughly to check the lab record to check all the virus they have stocked in their own uh code room I and mean, as i can mention now actually those code room are not under good su supervision i mean top expert as I know, like Prof. Manic Paris, he has an individual big code room out, out, P, out of P3 and uh, handled by yeah my husband, the WHO expert who now is helping them to uh, arrest me, try to keep me silence. So these people, they keep this code room for their clinical samples. And also I know they have done the illegal experience, uh, experiments in our P3 lab, like West Nile virus experiment at that time. And even my husband who handled it was very scared of. So all these things, even without record, I'm sure if they all we can open that lab, we can do the survey, uh, checking, even like General Chen Wei went to Wuhan's uh, Institute, Virus Institute since February 2020. They destroyed the evidence. We still can see the things unusual. And based on this, based on all, all these fake news, all those lies made up, uh, manipulated by CCP, WHO, this top expert, we definitely can understand what happened. And also the most important thing is I'm now preparing the very solid evidence just based on scientific evidence as CCP insists, right? You want to talk about science, let's talk about science. We just use science to say which side is right, which is truth. Let's talk about science based on the evidence. We need evidence, we need witness. We cannot let CCP silence everyone.